Hello everyone, Sigmalator here. Welcome back to Horizon Forbidden West. You got me all the way back on that one again. Yes, you have. Right, I've been doing some side quests, so I want to go back to the base. So I can uh, upload the, the data from some of these drones I've been collecting. I just want to see what good that does. Alright. Focus things trying to kill me. You did almost drown it in fear. Not on purpose. Where is it? This way. Oh, I need to talk to Erin about something as well. He called me while I was uh, searching for drones. Welcome back. Hello. Okay. Data modules in. An excellent choice. Nice. So is that all it does then? It just, uh, just shows the area that's been scanned. Oh, that looks cool, but I guess we can do better. What's this one? Ah, this might be Vegas. That's quite cool. Might leave it at that one. I'm back, Gaia. Hello, Aloy. What would you like to discuss? But anything so from what beta told me I guess we can assume the Zenith technology is powerful in all sorts of ways right yes as your encounters with them amply demonstrate they appear to make extensive use of robotic servitors Further, they seem to be equipped with some kind of protect energy field that shields them from they seem see. indestructible, but throughout history, every defensive while we lack were I to open no shield. So there's hope. Always. Uh yeah, this is just all nothing new. I'll be on my way. I wish you sick. Nothing new there then. All right, Erin, what did you want to talk about? I just don't get this last part. A long time no see. What else have you been studying with your focus? Yeah, I've been looking into this uh, Vegas place you found. Gaia showed us everything that happened when you went to get that Poseidon thing. I mean, this Moreland guy seems pretty smart, though. Risking the Tanakh clan lands for a light show is a bold move. Maybe I should check up on them at some point. Just in case. Right. No? Well, you had something for me. I should probably get going. Be careful out there. 
All right, okay. Guess there's nothing really else going on here. You got something new for us? I see you, champion. Be careful if you're traveling southwest, champion. Rebels have set up camp in the hills. I'm sure they'd be more than happy to dig your grave. Thanks for the warning. I've Sounds like the Tanakh could use a hand dealing with these rebels. Ah. For the rebel camp. Need to know second verse. Well, I could probably get on with some of these actually. Where's the closest campfire? Over here. Okay. May your armor hold true. I'm sure it will, thanks. Oh, I can override bristle banks. When did that happen? This is where Zoe said we'd find the Grim Horns she needs parts from to heal Plain Song's land gods. I should let her know I'm here. This image is of the old world. Looks like a plane and some kind of mineral structure. Huh, okay, that's annoying. Ah, oh, wait, hold on. I'll come back to this. This is now marked on the map. It is cool. Right, we'll deal with that. I wanted to harvest should be somewhere nearby. I should let her know I'm. Hey, Zo. I'm near the Grimhorn site. Can you join me? I'll be there soon. Aloy, I'm glad we can do this together. The Grimhorns we're looking for should be just to the north. Let's go get those control cores. Oh yeah, for the uh, land gods. Thank you again for helping me. If this works, if we can heal the land gods, it will end a generation of suffering for my people. How do you think Fane and the Chorus will take it? They seem to think the tribe's extinction is inevitable. I've had my disagreements with them, but I'd like to see they'll be happy to be wrong on this. There. The Grimhorns. And they're not alone. We'll just have to be smart about this. I'll follow your lead. just taken overlooking a field. Maybe I could try to line it up somewhere in the nearby hills.
Yeah, come check it out. Oh, you asshole. Oh, you asshole. I'm sorry, that was bullshit. It seems you have business elsewhere. I'll go back to base. Call me when you want to resume. What? What are you talking about? There. The Grim Horns. And they're not alone. We'll just have to be smart about this. I'll follow your lead. Okay, what am I doing? Kill the machines. Okay, but what am I doing specifically? Ammo could help you. Try and sneak up on one of these. See if that helps. I picked acid, what are you doing? Something wrong, hey! Oh, fuck's 
sake. Let's get those control doors. Pain subsiding. Jesus Christ, can, can you all fuck off? those things I pumped that thing so full of ammo there's no way it was clinging on to that bit of health I could look around with my focus try to match the vista point image there the grimhorns and they're not alone we'll just have to be smart about this I'll follow your lead Traps. I okay, think this used to be a Tanakh hunting, hunting ground Structure of some kind. Machines weak against frost. I don't have any frost traps, unfortunately. I do have a blast trap. You're weak to fire. Really? That missed? the fuck Would 
exactly where am I going? I'm trying not to die. Oh, fuck off. Ammo for Stick with the ammo I've selected.
<sighs> we did it. You Jesus. Okay? A bit winded, but I'll be all right. You've got the control cores. I can take them from here. Fuck me. That was not fun. Two control cores as requested. Thank you. Gaia showed me a way to scan them and take what we need to update the reboot code. I'll head back to base and get started. When I was a child, there was always enough to eat. The land gods provided for us, and every season we celebrated them. My happiest memories come from those times. Do you really think we can bring them back? We'll make it happen. Thank you, Aloy. Jesus. But this was a level 25 mission. I, I need some time to sort through those cores. I should do something else in the meantime. Yeah. Jesus Christ. Look at how much ammo I went through. I can make some of these, that's fine. Well, at least I've got some ammo. Talk to Zoe back at the base. Yeah, we can do that. Bloody hell. Hopefully this will help get things back on track. You know there used to be a rain forest so big the old ones called it the lungs of the planet? That sounds lovely. Yeah. Aloy, you're back. Varl looks pretty focused. He's been obsessing over the data revealed to us by Poseidon. Just the other day, we read about mountains hiding deep underwater that spew fire. If I understand correctly, Gaia said the flames they release come from the very center of the Earth. Like a heart beating with the life of the world. As always, the cycle can be found in even the most unlikely of places. Of course, Varl's mostly interested in watching explosions happen underwater. Now that you have those control cores, are you ready to reboot the land gods in plain cell? Not yet. Gaia told me the reboot code has to be altered using data from the cores. She updated my focus with software to accomplish this task, but apparently it's very complicated. It'll take time. Well, let me know if you need any help. I will. All right, cool. I should head out. Let me know if you need me. I'm Aloy. stuck. There are more supplies in the chest. Help oh, yourself. Yes. That's a good idea. Holograms. Gaia, I thought you said the data here was lost. I was able to repurpose the equipment to store the data you have acquired in your travels. It's a shuttle. Like the one I blew up at Farzina's launch facility. Varl seemed pretty interested in space travel. I guess he wanted a keepsake. Anything else? Oh, yes, there is. Right, where was my room again? I mean, that power cell downstairs must have. Turn on these holograms. <laughs> Looks like Arendt and Catalo moved their stuff in.
Nothing else around here? Oh no, that's the, uh, the seed storage, isn't it? Stopped on all of that. All right, I need more blast paste for everything else. That's fine. If you keep frowning that hard, you'll get wrinkles. I just don't get this last part. Maybe. We can look at it together later. Have a conversation about it. Okay. At least we've got that out of the way for now. So. You're all, all the way over there. I can fast travel close to it. Okay, so take you off and put you on. Wings holding up. There we go, that's the closest. My strength is yours. Good to know. Another conversation about. I guess they're just people I'm going to bump into randomly. Oh, good, more campfires unlocked. That's always good. Quite a sight, isn't it? Never thought I'd find myself this deep into Nock territory. Have you run into any trouble? I've been keeping my head down. Had to duck into the swamps a couple of times to avoid Tanakh patrols. Well, I'm here now, so spill it. Who is Amadis, really? Like I said before, he helped me put a stop to a hunter-killer machine out in the wilds. At first, he thought I was just another hunter from the lodge who only cared about the biggest machine trophy. And I thought he was just a grouchy hermit living in the woods. But then 
He trusted me with the truth, told me how the Red Raids took everything from him. Seeing that side of him, I don't know, changed things. You love him, don't you? I think I might, yeah. Then why did you part ways? When he told me how he failed to save the woman from his past, I told him how I made peace with my father and brother's deaths. He realized he needed to do the same on his own. Wait. When we searched that Red Raid's battlefield together, you said he'd lost someone close to him there. I thought you meant a fellow soldier. She was. Women aren't allowed to serve in the Karja army, but Nessa disguised herself so she could. Amadis kept her secret. When he left to come out west, he promised he'd send word that he was all right, but his letter never came. So you set out to find him. And when we do, I'll have words for him for leading us on this wild goose chase. Well, at least I kind of understand now. Amadis thought Nessa died on the battlefield, but when he learned that the Tanakh took prisoners back west, he kept going. So I guess now we find this prison, the Rot. I did some scouting while I was waiting. I think I might have found the way. Lead on then. I hope this Amadis isn't a douche. Do you think Nessa might still be alive? I doubt it. Any Karja prisoners from the Red Raids would have been killed or returned home by now. Then what's Amadis after? I think he just needs to know. Yeah, closure. I get it. I think he's on me. Get some backups because I am. I used a lot against those machines earlier. Ha! Over here, you flaming hunk of scrap! That's him! Firefox right on his heels. Come on! Got you! We've got your back! Oh, shit. Oh, I forgot they could do that. Can you knock that shit off, sir? This way. Okay, oh, damn it. Reach level thirty, yes. God damn it. Talana, I... You were supposed to let me know you were okay. I was going to send the message right after I crossed into the desert with an Osaram caravan. But when it became clear that the tunnel had collapsed behind us, I figured the only thing I could do was press on. Seeing as you found a way out here, however, clearly I was wrong. I'm sorry. The last thing I wanted was to worry you. So, you must be Amadis. And you must be Aloy. 
Falan has told me a lot about you. And I guess you must know about me. Uh, a little. We know you're headed for the rot. But what are you hoping to find there? A clue. Or a shred of one. Anything about Ness's fate. Maybe she died on the battlefield. Or maybe she wasted away in that prison. Either way, I have to know. Talana told me about you and Nessa during the Red Raids. That you kept her secret. We were both assigned to the Southern Spear Division. Our orders were to push into Tanakh territory through the tunnel. She was proud to serve the Sunda at first. But as the atrocities mounted, we both saw the raids for what they were. And the two of you grew close? We did what we could to protect innocent lives. It felt like we were the only ones who objected to the slaughter. And yes, we were close until the Battle of the Burning Blooms. What happened at the Battle of the Burning Blooms? I had intel that the Tanakh forces were greater than we had anticipated. I tried to convince my commander to halt the attack. He was a drunken lout. And when I threatened to reveal his incompetence to Karja High Command, he pulled a knife on me. So I killed him. In self-defense. It was still murder. I was condemned. But I thought at least I could still save Nessa. I was too late. By the time I got to the battle, the fields were already burning. Our soldiers slaughtered or missing. What's more, the commander I had killed was from a powerful noble house. They put a bounty on my head. I've been on the run ever since. The Red Raids are long over. Sun King Avad would pardon you if he knew... The Sun King can't help me. A pardon from Avad won't stop bounty hunters eager to claim their prize. Fair enough. So, you and Talana, um, sounds like the two of you had an adventure out in the wilds. Claw Striders, a hunter killer, mercenaries, a shell snapper. Nothing could get in our way. A scruffy hermit in the woods certainly tried. That was foolish of him, in hindsight. All right, you two, enough flirting. Well, we're here now, so let's head to the rot. I can't ask you to come with me. I feel bad enough you've come this far. I didn't come all this way just to leave you now. We'll see this through together. I know better than to try to talk you out of it. Come then. The rot's not far. Don't be a traitor. The rot's along the shore, but we'll have to stick to the woods to avoid being seen. Mm. How did you find it? I overheard a Tanakh patrol. You with us, Nora? Yeah. Then let's get going. Sorry, had to go deal with something. No, I didn't. We were talking about something before I left. As I was saying, I overheard a Tanakh patrol from the nearby village talking about it. Figured it out from there. What were you gonna do if we hadn't found you? Take it on alone? I only need to question one guard. All right, so this is the rot, eh? There it is. The rot. Those are Regal's rebels. They're waging civil war against the rest of the Tanakh. They must have taken over the prison. Then they would have killed any of the guards. They were my last hope of finding out if Nessa was there. Maybe not. There might still be some clue inside. Even after all this time? Aloy can see much more than you or I. And let's do it. Any scrap of hope is better than nothing. We'll have to find another way in. The front gate looks impenetrable. And there's no way we're scaling those walls. You two stay here. I'll see if I can find another way in and get that gate open. I should check around the sides. Might be a way in from the water. I've got prisoners.
Ah, uh, here we go. Away in. Refreshing. Gotta get to the main gate to let Talana and Amadis in. Grab this on the go. You guys in for a scrap? Because it's coming. Show me where. Because I don't see a damn thing. Any Sorry. Sign of the enemy. That one's on me. <laughs> False alarm. Was it though? It wasn't as silent as I thought it would be, but... I know they are. We'll get this gate open. That was something. We'll come and have a look. Look around. Call if you see anything. I can't see anything here. I guess we scared them all. That Easterner will be caught, and the punishment will be severe. You see that? Stop talking. Start searching. Get searching! Here we go. quicker than you. Another one down. 
Get out! Dodge my arrow. I need this. Taking my shot. Uh -huh. Outlanders. That device is gonna call a machine. Mm. Oh, too late. Oh, good, one of these. I need health. Fuck. Any more big guns? Oh, 
Oh, you asshole! Christ, will you fucking move? Come on. Dead. All right, I think that's the end of it. Fucking hell. Hear that? Yeah, hold on. Let me just. Jesus Christ. Here. Door's locked, but that last rebel had a key on it. Freed by Karja? Have we not been humiliated enough? It's not their fault you were locked up in your own prison. I'm looking for information about a Karja soldier. She might have been a prisoner here five years back. Her name was Nessa. The Karja Nessa was here. I killed her myself. Nessa? I'll handle this. Go secure the grounds. It's you, isn't it? Nessa, how? It's Why? Rataka. Uh, let me get this straight. You were Nessa. You were brought here as a prisoner during the Red Raids, and then became Tanakh? The Karja forbid women from military service. I lived my life pretending, ashamed of who I really was. But the Tanakh measure a soldier only by their strength and resolve. So I took my place among them. Ness... Rataka, I've mourned you for five years. Why didn't you let me know you were alive? I had a new life. I wasn't going back. Not even for you, Amadis. The way Amadis talked about your time together, I thought you'd still care about him. It was five years ago. I didn't abandon you. Before the battle, I tried to get Gadiah to call off the attack, but of course, he didn't listen. I ended up killing him. Then he got what he deserved. I ran for the battlefield to find you. But you were already gone by the time I got there. I didn't know. But even if I did, I mourned you, and then I moved on. Cold, but... Life, go, life does go prisoner, on. How did you become Tanakh? 
I knew it was only a matter of time before the Tanakh killed me and the others who were held captive. But one day, one of their soldiers stopped in front of my cell, asked how a woman had ended up fighting for the Mad Sun King. As he spoke, I realized he was once Karja. Fashav. I heard how he fell at the embassy. He deserved a better death than that. The other prisoners he condemned to death, but he convinced the Tanakh to let me fight for my life. I won through blood and blade. I became Rataka and never looked back. You were willing to wear a disguise so that you could serve in the Karja army. Do you miss being Karja at all? No. The Red Raids showed me there was no honor in fighting for the Karja. And when my comrades and I were brought here as prisoners, we knew no one would ever come for us. I would have, had I known. It's better this way. Beneath my Karja armor, I found I had the blood of a Tanakh. So if you became Tanakh, how did you end up as a prisoner here again? My squad was ordered to retake the rot from Regala's rebels. We failed. Considering how much Regala seems to hate the Karja, I'm surprised her rebels let you live. You're right. I'd be dead if they knew. But few Tanakhs remember who I once was. What will you do now? You've taken back the rot. My squad will ensure it stays that way. So this is it? After everything we've been through, this is goodbye? It has to be. My place will always be here, and yours is back east. I'm sorry that you've suffered. You deserve better than how the last five years have treated you. I'll make sure you're granted safe passage out of the lowland. Consider it Nessa's final farewell. Well, you got your closure. At least now you know the truth. Somehow it hurts worse. You must think I'm an idiot. No, I just think you have a lot to figure out. I'll take you back east to the Sendem. After that, I don't know. Talana, I understand. I'm sorry it came to this. Me too. Give me an Aloy a moment. Are you alright? To be honest, no. What's going to happen between you two? I'm not sure. He clearly has a lot more feelings to sort through. And I won't be anyone's second choice. I want you to have this. For seeing this through with me. No hawk could ask for a better thrush. Or a better friend. So... I guess this is it then. You're heading back east. I think I'll hang around Baron Light for a while before returning to Meridian. If you find yourself back that way, look for me there. I will. Safe travels, Talana. Damn. Maybe I should check in with her the next time I'm at Baron Light. Maybe. Oops. Here we go. What are you? Go and then you. Mounted defense, take less damage while mounted. Yes. Half moon slash. Ooh. I should probably finish these off. There we go. Five. Camp. That's level 18, is it? Seems like she could lose a shoulder to lean on. Cool. All right, we're sending me back to to there. Right, 
Right, let's head to the campfire. This isn't over. Regala will gather her forces. I'm sure she will. Good, I think so. Is what's his face still here? Doesn't look like it. Seems Regala is our common enemy. All right. There we go. And I'm going to end this episode here. Thank you very much for taking the time to watch this, guys. If you liked it, like, subscribe, ding that bell. I'll be sick later. This has been Horizon Forbidden West, and I'll catch you next time. Take care now.